We are back for some more of my gameplay on Wii Sports Resort for the Nintendo Wii. We just got done with power cruising at the end of the last car, but now we're going to go to the next sport on this game and uh, we'll see how that goes. So next up we're going to do some canoeing. We'll just do a speed challenge. We're just going to do beginner. Alright, time to test my limits. So basically we're trying to get as far as we can within 60 seconds. We're basically following some duckies on this one. So when you first uh, do this game on all the difficulties, you gotta try to get to a certain number of yards, but um, if you actually manage to clear them all, then you can actually do this thing to see uh, how far you could possibly go within the amount of time that you have. Five seconds left. Alright, time's up. And we got 254.05 yards. I said that was pretty good. We only go up two, but it's at least worth something. Alright, time to go to the next sport, and this time we're gonna do cycling. Let's do a road race. Alright, this is our one of these sports on here that requires me to use the dunk chuck, so let's plug that back in. We're just going to do a one stage race, and uh, we're just going to go around the island. Of course there's multiple courses to choose from on this game as well. So what's cool about this is that before the start of the race you can actually get an overview of the entire course. Alright, let's go! So we're gonna start off at 30th place. I just gotta keep shaking the mirror on the nunchuck very fast to, uh, to get some speed going. And also, depending on the amount of stages for races that you do, it depends on how many races there are. Try to ride behind the cyclists in front of you to drive them. So there's Vincenzo uh, giving you some tips. Uh, all throughout the race right here, which is pretty cool. We also got to pay careful attention to our health that we have right here. Uh, save air, oh, that's it, save energy by dropping on the cyclists in front of you. Watch out for the strong cross as you get out of the tunnel. All you don't want to go very fast or very long, because uh, if you do, then you'll uh, run out of health right here and it'll give you a moment to uh, actually get uh, your entire health back. Just trying to watch my speed very carefully here. Alright, we're getting some of our health back here, that's good news. If you uh, maintain the draft behind one of the other cyclists, that's a good way of getting your health back very quickly. Get out of my way. Alright, we're halfway there now. There's a long winding hill up ahead. Keep your energy up. I like that on this uh, portion of the course right here. It actually has your bee's name on it uh, right there, so that's pretty interesting. There's a strong crosswind going out to the sea. Be careful. Gotta be careful with these bananas that are on the ground right here on this part of the course. Oh god, we're running low on health. Right, we're almost there. 
Wait for the break time and then sprint for the finish line. Well, this is going to be a close battle here for the win. Very out in first place right now. And right, that's the finish line. Wow, that was really close, but I just cannot believe I just pulled it off like that. Nice. Wow, how about that? <laughs> Looks like it won't affect our rating at all since it didn't change. Alright. Now there's only uh, one more sport left to play, and that is basically the uh, air sports. So we're going to do a couple of those to wrap things up for this gameplay. So uh, we're going to do some skydiving. Now, this game is actually based off of the uh, opening cutscene when you first play uh, Wii Sports Resort, which is uh, pretty cool. I have a record of 151 points right here. Okay, here we go. So along the way, we're going to try to link up with the uh, other sky divers. Alright, let's do it. Last balls, got perfect catch, and also along the way, uh, you can also get pictures right here. And uh, if, if the means are facing in front of the camera, then you'll get an even better result for that kind of picture. You couldn't quite grab one of those bees in time right there, but it's all right. trying to go through some rings. And once we do go through those rings, those bees who are forming the ring will actually fly on down with you. Alright, time to get one final picture. Alright, there we go. I said that was pretty good. Now let's see what our final score is. 128 points, not too bad. And you can also view all the foes you've taken off throughout the game right here, which is pretty cool. Alright, how's it affect our rating? Oh, it didn't even get changed at all, alright. But anyways, uh... We're gonna do one more game on Air Sports to finish things off for this gameplay. And we're gonna finish things off with an Island Flyover. And there are different times of day that you can play in on here, which is quite cool, but we'll just go in the daytime. Alright, here we go. So basically all throughout uh, this game, uh, you have uh, five minutes to try to get as many eye points around the island as possible. And you can also try to go for a uh, uh, some balloons as well if you like to, which is quite nice. Alright, we got 
pretty piece to start off, and we also got the basketball court. There's the bowling alley. There's the store play coliseum. And we got Sundown Point. There's the Hillside Cabins. We got Town Rock. We got the Wishing Fountain. There's the Whale Shark. And once you do find a certain number of eye points around the island, then you can actually get a uh, certain reward in this kind of game. Which that was a pretty cool thing that they did. Alright, let's keep looking for us uh, some eye points along the way. Let's go up here. We have the candle. When you do get close to it, uh, it actually makes a pretty weird noise, which I don't know why it does that. Kind of possibly lose over here too while we're at it. Horse Monument. We have Duckling Lake. And right here we have Summerstone Castle. We've got Summerstone Falls. Got the Footbridge. I kind of touched the water right there, but at least we did save ourselves right there. I got Red Iron Bridge. And we'll finish this up when we come back.